first and foremost, where is Mark? <laughs> My guess, Hawaii. Um, that's kind of his MO. He gets in trouble, something goes bad, he gets scared, he runs away. So I would put money on him being in Hawaii. Okay, so you're a business partner with this couple. It's not the greatest, uh, you know, producing partnership you've ever had in your life. It's a nightmare, as I have read about your experience. But now that you hear Tatiana has been hauled in on charges that she was soliciting a, a murder for two million, and she's in jail, and and he's vanished. What are what do you what's your read on this? What do you make of this whole development? Um, karma, as far as I'm concerned, but. It's, uh, uh, I think she's completely full of it with all of her accusations. Mark is not an aggressive person, at least not everything. He's very meek and not, not, not an aggressive person. The only time I ever saw him be aggressive was from behind a screen, like an email or something. Uh, so I, I don't, I doubt that he had any of the, any of the stuff she's accusing him. I, I doubt, um, he pretty much Can is I just a yes. There is a picture I want to show you, Eric, a picture, and she's at a party with him. It's, I think it's part of this whole party scene, but she's got a belt. I think it's his belt around his neck, and she's yep. leading him sort of around the party. That's the one there. The, yep. It looks like it's all part of the same party. It's the same white dress. But, yep. I mean, this one stopped me in my tracks, given the fact that I'm getting the, the feeling that she was quite domineering. Yeah, he did whatever she said. Didn't matter if it was a good idea, bad idea, made no difference. She, I mean, this picture really represents how the relationship was. He got drug around by her doing what she wanted with no real saying it. He just threw money at whatever it is she she wanted to do it. He threw money at it. That was that was basically their relationship. And um, in this, and this particular fifty thousand dollars a month. That she said in their divorce, like that she spent fifty thousand dollars a month to live. Did that sound about right to you? Is that you witnessed their lifestyle? Did that look like it was? Yep, that's what they spent. Yeah. No. She uh, <laughs> during the during the show, she showed up one day with a horse and was like, "Oh, look, I just got this horse. I only spent seventy thousand dollars on him." The asking price for the horse at the time had been thirty k, so she managed to spend forty thousand dollars more than the asking price just because she decided she wanted that horse and someone saw a sucker written on her face, I guess. Holy so, yeah. Dinah. Can... Eric, you know what, Eric? This story's not going away. She's, uh, like I said earlier, she's got a, um, she has an appearance coming up, so we're going to follow it, and I'd love to call you back. Do you think you're going to be, I only have 10 seconds, do you think you're going to be called to testify in any of this? I have no idea. I really didn't think I'd be called at all, and then all of a sudden I got people like you hit me up, so... Who knows? Right. Guess we'll see. Well, I'm, I'm not going to stop. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.